Yamaha presents The Whitetail Diaries, chronicling hunting adventures of the most plentiful and intelligent big game animal in North America. Join top whitetail hunters nationwide. Embark on the amazing adventure that is hunting the whitetail deer. Today on the Yamaha Whitetail Diaries. Well, Steve Nessel from Yamaha is in camp at the beginning of rifle season, where he'll be heading out to a spot known as the Sheep Bluff, which is popular among the mature whitetail deer of the area. Plan this year was to find a mature and older deer that would either be a, a trophy, a wall hanger, or a management buck, a coal, and, and again, in my case, a coal half the time because it can be so cool looking, so different, and have so many different, you know, different characteristics to it are almost just as much a trophy. Um, and again, they're always freezer fodder. So um, come down with the goal of, of looking for a good, you know, a, a buck that strikes my fancy, if you will. Jeff and I hunted exclusively via the Wolverine this hunt. Having a three seat vehicle like the Viking wasn't gonna be necessary and the Wolverine, you know, being a dedicated two seater was gonna work fine for our purposes. And we threw our stuff in the back of the Wolverine and, and we took off. and. Uh, it's just a sweet ride. I mean, I think we were probably doing at times, you know, we, Jeff has a joke about my slow is 15 to 25 and his slow is 5 to 15. Uh, it just amazes me how quickly the Wolverine can get over some of those ranch roads in comfort. Um, you know, you take a truck through there and you're doing half, if that, the speed and you're bouncing around. And not that speed is, is necessarily a, a, a key component to a, a hunt, but just to be able to get from point A to point B with, uh, you know, if it's cold or you know, you got to go help somebody and you can cut the time um, and ultimately the distance by, by them being in a, in a vehicle like the Wolverine, it, it, it's, why not? Now, if you need more room for passengers or storage, Yamaha has a brand new line of the ever popular Viking side-by-side. -side. With class leading cab room and comfort, coupled with superior handling and proven off-road capability, Vikings are the toughest and hardest working utility-based side-by-side vehicles that are also fun to drive. Yamaha is introducing a new metallic sand ranch edition Viking. The Viking 6 ranch edition will don the same new color and features along with a color match soft sun top, rear bed grab bar, and heavy duty front brush guard. Hey, if you're more into the ATV side of things, Yamaha has expanded their lineup and have added the all new Kodiak 450. The new Kodiak 450 offers the ultimate balance of comfort confidence and capability with a list of customization options to suit the wide variety of needs for our expanding community of outdoorsmen and women, farmers, ranchers, and adventure-seeking off-road enthusiasts. Developed with accessory integration in mind, the Kodiak 450 is designed for easy installation of genuine Yamaha accessories, including a new highly integrated winch and mounting plate kit custom over fenders, gun boot mounts, rack extensions, cooler carries, and more. View additional details on Yamaha's entire proven off-road side-by-side and ATV lineup at yamahamotorsports.com. All right, now let's catch back up with Steve Nessel in the field. We're the third day into the firearm season here in Texas, and uh, I get, get to go chase whitetails for the first time since I've been out here this trip. And, we're actually going to go ahead to a place called the Sheep Bluff. That's one of my probably top five places to hunt. I got out here last year hunting a big, big deer that we actually ended up taking our super old, big body, but just a full character, kind of a cull, but a trophy to me. So always a good time out here. I can't, I'm looking forward to it. And uh, no offense, done talking to a camera, so we're going to get out there. When we return, we'll see if the Sheep Bluff will bless Steve with another opportunity. The Yamaha Whitetail Diaries is brought to you by Yamaha ATV and Side-by-Sides. Real world tough. Cabela's, it's in your nature. Garmin Rhino 7 Series. Wherever you hunt, make it Rhino Country.
The full line of Yamaha ATVs and side-by-side -side vehicles with class-leading durability and reliability. All real-world tough. It's in our stomping grounds and our playground. It's in our sights and our commitment. It's in him, it was in them, and it will continue with her. It's in my nature. Is it in yours? The outdoors. It's been my playground for decades. I enjoy everything about it. Like me, I bet you also look at the outdoors as your own personal playground. And like me, I bet you're always looking for the newest challenge. So come join me and my Smith & Wesson Performance Center handgun and let's share a new experience in the outdoors. Performance when it matters most from the Smith & Wesson Performance Center. The art of the hunt is not painted with a broad brush. Its eye is in the details. The note on the refrigerator. A set of broadheads, tried and true. The well-worn boots, soaked in dough estrus. And a Garmin Rhino, the only GPS with two-way radio. Clear the rhubarb out of the freezer. It's whitetail season in Rhino country. Welcome back to the Yamaha Whitetail Diaries with Wade Middleton. Steve Nessel is set up at the Sheep Bluff and he's hunkered down in search for a mature whitetail. The reason we went there was because of the sun. It was the afternoon hunt and the sun was going to be setting but there were no clouds and we wanted a spot where we weren't going to get blasted. It was pretty warm that we weren't gonna get blasted. So the reason, the primary reason we picked the spot was because we are gonna get shaded. And I ended up loving the setup. We're, you're tucked into a tree, you, you know, where the deer are coming through and where they're milling about it, feeding. Actually, it could, be, it could be off to your left at about 50, but mostly it was about 120, 100 to 180, just kind of out on this hill on this ridge. Gorgeous spot and shaded. And so you're tucked in, you're camouflaged, you're comfortable. Uh, I had a good arrest for the gun. You know, everything was set up. And immediately I looked down off to our left and there is a monster. I actually thought it was an axis deer. It was just, just boom. Ridiculously stud toad of a deer walks in. And I know pretty much right away that he's probably not on the hit list, that, he, that he's on a list that, that Wade's gonna say, no, don't shoot that deer. And I, I look at him and he's just, he's too bull. You can't even really do him justice by explaining him. And he's just so tall and he's wide and he's gorgeous. Well, as the sun starts to go down, another deer walks in, and this time, Steve has the green light. Oh my goodness. That's his brother.
Well, I don't even know where to start. I don't even know where to start. The Yamaha Whitetail Diaries is brought to you by Conquest Sense, hunting sense and dog training sense. Bradley Smoker, food smoking made easy. High vis shooting systems. See what you've been missing. Smith and Wesson Performance Center. Performance when it matters most. High vis shooting systems knows that your shooting performance matters in all conditions. All high vis shooters experience faster target acquisition with our durable light wave sights. Featuring easily interchangeable light pipes. Light wave sights give your eyes the exact sight picture you crave. Shoot high vis. See what you've been missing. Efficient power, shooting 370 feet per second at only 140 pounds of draw weight. The ultralight Eclipse RCX boasts next generation reverse cam technology, taking your performance to inspiring new levels. 10 point, perfection lives here. You work hard to put feed where you need it, when you want it. And thanks to our patented Spintech spinner mechanism that elevates up and down, you'll no longer have feed go to waste due to wind or unwanted varmints. When the motor is shut off, the spinner plate is automatically pushed up tight and sealed against the hopper, protecting your feed. Stop wasting your time and let the Spintech technology work for you. The thing about public land is that most people hunt the same old beaten path. The thing about you is, you're not most folks. Introducing the new TC Compass, only by Thompson Center. Follow your own compass with America's master gun maker. What does it take to make Evercom deer scent? It takes a deer farmer who raises whitetails. It takes mixing the special blend of Evercom, testing each batch. That smells good. And then pouring each container. Once it's cooled, each container is cleaned, examined, and packaged for shipping. It takes the finest deer herd and a great team of people to make the best hunting scent available. Evercom from Conquest Scents. Stealth Cam. Proven reliability. Proven quality. Proven performance. Stealth Cam continues to push the boundaries of technology and innovation with its next generation of trail cameras. Proven performance in extreme conditions. Proven. Stealth Cam. Join the Trail Cam revolution. Ingalls got the original high performance cooler and a whole lot more. Ingle coolers go with the original. Hey, Steve just took a shot at a monster of a buck, but unfortunately, the bullet went high, just missing the deer. It's we're about last light. He came in late, super late, and uh, I don't don't know why. I decided I wasn't going to shoot him, and then at the last second, I decided I was gonna. 
None of that mattered because I shot and missed. As the way he looked up, turned, he's a stud of a deer, stud of a deer. And uh, just a hoss. And I guess a silver lightning right here as he's coming back. He's coming back, don't move. Well, if anyone was gonna get a second chance at a deer like this, it would be Steve, AKA Old Two Shot. Huh. The nickname Old Two Shot originated from his previous hunts, where it take more than one bullet for Steve to harvest a whitetail. So, let's see if old Two Shot can live up to his name. But he's running out of time, as it's almost getting too dark for the camera. You got enough light or no? Okay. The Yamaha Whitetail Diaries is brought to you by Thompson Center, America's master gunmaker. Sawyer Products, we keep you outdoors. Angle Coolers, a legend in reliability. The Bubba Blade 4 inch gut hook, featuring mossy oak breakup country, fashions a high carbon stainless steel blade built perfectly to meet your needs. Designed for effective precision cutting. The famous Bubba Blade Handle, featuring Mossy Oak Breakup Country, providing ultimate control when harvesting your game. Bubba Blade, the ultimate sportsman's knife. Purina's Quick Draw is the perfect solution for attracting deer to your location and providing them with the essential nutrients that will encourage their growth. Use these blocks where you can and I promise you, not only are you gonna see more game, but the game's gonna benefit from you placing it out. Hercules Outdoor Industries is the new leader in hunting blinds. However you hunt, Hercules is the one blind for all needs. Hercules blinds are entirely made in the USA using high quality fiberglass components that can last through rain, snow, and all those cold winters. All Hercules fiberglass hunting blinds are foam insulated and carpeted, and Hercules Outdoor Industries will arrange to have it delivered directly to you. Find out more at HerculesOutdoors.com. When you're out hunting, make sure you're carrying Grove Tech. Grove Tech is designed specifically for the rigorous demands of the hunt and sets the standard for strength and ruggedness when out in the field. Grove Tech products have simply built the best tools for the job and are proudly made in the USA. Go hunt. We'll carry the gun. Grove Tech. Since 1984, Sawyer Products has offered the most technologically advanced solutions for protection against sun and bugs. Sawyer Picaridin Insect Repellent is effective against mosquitoes and flies. It's safe on you and your gear. And to maximize your protection, use a combination of Picaridin with odorless permethrin for your clothing and gear. Sawyer Stay Put Sunscreen will keep you comfortable and getting better protection for even longer. You're already outdoors. Sawyer keeps you there. Every day, your eyes are exposed to dust, debris, and wind. 
only Wiley X removable gaskets. Block it all out. And your eyes remain safe. Wiley X, absolute premium protection for sportsmen. Protect it or lose it. 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 Hey, if you're just tuning in, Steve Nestle had the opportunity to harvest a gigantic mature buck, but buck fever got the best of him, which resulted in a clean miss. But the deer came back and has blessed Steve with the opportunity on another shot at this mature whitetail. I apologize. I, I'm, this is not staged. I did not take two shots on purpose. Evidently, I'm a horrible first shot when I'm all amped up and there is a monster deer on the ground out there that for whatever reason decided to bless me with a second opportunity. It's super dark. Yes, no, yes, no, yes, no, a flip-flop. I'm probably not gonna be able to articulate myself very well right here, right now. But this is the third Texas deer for me and I am blessed enough to take three really good sized Texas deer over the last 10 years that not only I whiffed on with the first shot, but came back and offered me a second shot. And now have expired right there. That guy is a monster too. I, I don't know, people are gonna laugh at me. <laughs> They're gonna make fun of me. I don't do this on purpose, <laughs> but there's a dead deer down there and uh, I can see him. We're gonna grab the Wolverine. We're gonna get him, we're gonna camp and people are gonna get him. They're gonna laugh at me the way this went down. No harm, no foul. There is a <laughs> monster deer on the, I, what, Jeff? <laughs> I, they're gonna start thinking I'm doing all this per, I don't want to perpetuate the two shot legend I really do not. It is not my intent. And I think somewhere, somewhere a God, or someplace somewhere, there's a God that's like, just, just writing me favors. He's just, just extending me these favors and letting me do right by the animals. I mean, it was a no harm, no foul thing, clean mess. He went away. I was embarrassed, still am. Um, I'm super excited and happy all at the same time. Let's pack up, let's get out of here. And I could tell Jeff was thinking maybe, just maybe. Just the camera's pointing at me and I'm trying to talk about how stupid I feel. And Jeff's thinking maybe, just maybe. And here comes this monster head of horns coming right back at us. And it's so dark right now, it's sitting really, really dark. We st I still have plenty of light, but it was about whether or not the camera did. Um, we got her done. We got her done. Such an awesome animal. And I even have my hands on him yet. So I think uh, since we don't have to track and he's laying right there, I think that's exactly what we'll do is we'll get our hands on him. We'll, uh, we'll talk about him when we're up next to him and then we'll get the, with the, the Wolverine out here and we'll take him back to camp and then people can make fun of me all they want while I stand over the top of this just gorgeous deer. So it's not how you'd write it up, but it went down and, and he is down.
<laughs> Woo. Oh. Oh. My goodness. Oh. oh, wow. Ouch, cactus. Oh, my goodness. Look at this guy. Sorry about the spare, scare big guy, but... Thank you for the second opportunity. Again, there's somebody looking out for me when it comes to that kind of stuff. Speechless. Heard a little bit about this guy. Watched his, we think, younger brother in the field for a long time this afternoon. We're told if the older brother, same 10 frame comes in, Ten, but I'm counting more on one side. That he was fair game. And I decided to shoot him, or I should say try. Scared him, but not enough to get him all the way out of the field. And he came back and gave me another chance. This guy is a stud and he is ridiculously cool. And I love it. I I love, he doesn't come out very far, but he comes in, he's just a couple inches from touching, twos and threes are enormous. <sighs> Talked about how I may get made fun of because of this two shot reputation that I've unfortunately earned for myself, but when it comes to animals like this, He dropped right where he was standing the second time I let a bullet fly, so. Thank you. Stand proud, old two-shot, and congratulations on another entry into the Yamaha Whitetail Diaries. Oh, hey, and remember, if you're looking for a brand new ATV or side-by-side, -side, be sure to check out the complete lineup of Yamahas at YamahaMotorsports.com. Well, That'll do it for us here on the Yamaha Whitetail Diaries. And all of a sudden, he just kind of just ghost. He ghosted in. And we saw a deer looking in the back, but all of a sudden, it's like boom. <laughs> And uh, that little <gasps> made its way through my first shot, which <laughs> I can explain more about later. <laughs> Freaking came back! The legend of old two shot lives on. <laughs>